this is Ottawa, a eh? capital of Canada apparently. You get the feeling it might be about to rain. You can feel it coming in the air, as Phil Collins once said. Just like being in England, this. We're looking for a spot called, here we go, Wellington Diner. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that was nice of to stop last minute. Got all these ferns and plants around. Almost tropical. Hi, um, you have like a burger challenge? Like yes. A burger and pizza yeah. challenge? So it's two burgers and a double part of one pizza. Okay. And then a chocolate peanut butter shake. Do you have any allergies at all? I do not have allergies, no. That's all delicious chocolate and peanut butter. Chocolate peanut butter is good, yeah, but it's yummy. It's pretty big. It is quite big. You guys take it very seriously then. Don't fill out a waiver. The last guy that did it threw up at a table. Yeah, yeah. Did he clean it up? Yeah? yeah? Well, that was polite of him at least. It was, it was the throw up at the table and then continued to eat, thinking that it's so good. Oh. And I was like, that's uh, not the problem. You, you kept going? Yeah. Oh my yeah, that's god. Exactly, yeah. That was disgusting. Break up the protein a little bit. Because it's bacon, ham, sausage, and home fries for the season, and then hollandaise. So it's salty and it's rich. Right, okay. So if you leave all the protein to last, it's hard to eat from one go. That right. makes sense? <laughs> yeah, okay. Is this Phil Collins? I mentioned Phil Collins in the car. He's got vocal range. See what you like about Phil Collins. The dude can sing. And drum a little bit. Come on, Randy, man. I don't want to follow you. I just want to use your website. This is what we're doing today. Robinson Diner's Mac Daddy Burger Challenge. Randy's given it four out of five stars for difficulty. Doesn't bode well. Challenge constitutes two monstrous Mac Daddy burgers, a double carnival poutine, and a peanut butter and chocolate milkshake. I like the sound of that part. Apparently you get a free meal and a free trophy. Is an actual trophy? Like a golden cup style trophy or what? This is it. No, oh, that's actually the waitress that was just serving me a second ago. I'm as ready as I will ever be. Ooh, it's here. Do you think I can eat all that? No. Look Looking at me, you don't think so? Nope. No? <laughs> no. Well, I'm gonna try. This is the Wellington Diner, the Wellington right? Which is in uh, Ottawa, right? Pretty Ottawa, much. Yeah. They call it the Mac Daddy Challenge, right? Yes. Do you know how many people have failed, have tried and failed? Like everyone. So there's only been done once, except one guy. You get 40 minutes? 40 minutes. 40 minutes. And um, if you do it, it's, it's free? If you, if you finish? Well, Oh, right. well, you got any tips? What, which should I eat first? I don't know. <laughs> Be smart, but you don't know. All right, cool. All right. I'm ready. We are starting. Yeah? Bye. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to episode 12 in the Canada 2022 series. Today, we're at the Wellington Diner in Ottawa doing battle with their Mac Daddy Challenge, which allegedly has only been trumped once. You get 40 minutes to finish two Mac Daddy beef burgers and a huge pile of their breakfast protein. I think they call it the, the carnivore poutine, actually, which is quite appropriate. So I suppose it's kind of like a brunch challenge. Apparently weighs in at seven pounds, which is hard to judge, but I suppose there is about five pounds of poutine here. I can't imagine the burgers were a pound each, though. Maybe. Who knows? Hard to tell. Oh. I'm definitely going to do it now. Chris the Burr's playing. What a tune. <laughs> wow, that is embarrassing. Did I say that out loud? I meant to just think that, I'm sure. It's like admitting you like Enya or Tina Arena or something. <laughs> this is delicious. Hey, the magic word. It was delicious too. It's always easy to make haste when a food challenge actually tastes good. And these burgers were great. Supple, salty, rich. Très bien. I think we'll get rid of that. I don't know why I'm drinking that anyway. It's just extra liquid. The straw's not gonna work. That's not gonna cut it. Whoa, the shake is thick. Yeah, the shake's really more like an ice cream, which has been left out in the sun for like three minutes. Not that there was a great deal of sunlight on this particular day, but uh, again, the taste was top class. If you ask me, you can't really go wrong with chocolate and peanut butter and a milkshake. You'd have to be doing something terribly wrong to, to mess that up, I think. Oh, this food is lush.
I don't see any cheese curds though, so it's not real poutine, but it's delicious. <laughs> I'm glad nobody was around to hear that particular utterance. I know folks out here get quite protective when it comes to the authenticity of their poutine, but my understanding is that poutine is fries, cheese curds and gravy. Not diced potatoes with cheese and hollandaise sauce. Still, it tasted good, just not sure it qualifies as actual poutine. I wonder if I can get this done before the waitress comes back to check on me. That would be funny. Yeah, well, you might have to get a wriggle on then, Slowpoke. I'm sorry about the light in this video, by the way. I, I used the wrong meat remote on my camera. <laughs> I was hoping nobody would notice, but watch it back, it's all over the place. <laughs> so I'm coming clean. There was a sexy drone shot at the beginning, though. That's usually enough to distract people into thinking I am somewhat professional. <laughs> this really is dynamite. She's coming back, I think, now. <laughs> Are you checking under the table? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Where is it? We have 29 minutes left. Oh, 29 minutes left? I can relax then. I want to see this on YouTube. I'm going to see it. I need to see. And if you hear it, someone will call on your thing. Okay? <laughs> but you think I hid it somewhere? Maybe. Where did I hide it? <laughs> yeah, I hit it. <laughs> I promise. Huh? Um, I love it. Can I get like a Diet Coke or something like that? Thank you. <laughs> she just went down, there's like a, I'm on the top level, she just went down some stairs. And she was peering like to see, you know, at eye level, if she could see anything on the floor. <laughs> what a reaction! I knew that naff little table camera would come in handy one day. I can't believe she thought I was cheating! I just gotta finish the milkshake now. Yeah. Yeah, I just gotta polish off the milkshake, then claim that trophy. Which actually just turns out to be a t-shirt. But you're not gonna catch me complaining about that. Hope you enjoyed it. And I'll catch you at the next one. That is banging though. Only thing it's missing is a bit of bacon. Better wait here. I get the feeling that I might be subject to an inspection. There's a little uh, mezzanine level thing here. They probably think I've been hoying food over the side. <laughs> Sick. No, no, I feel, I feel fine. Oh, that was the best tasting one so far, by a mile. Flipping yums. I can't believe that that was only. That's only been beaten once. I wonder who clocked it. Oh, the trophy's incoming. Oh, look at that. It's I love nice. a good t shirt. It is nice. Look at it. I like it. Thank you very much. Making out of here just in time. They started playing terrible dance music. <laughs> oh, no. We don't. <laughs> no, 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 no. Nobody needs to hear that.